Have you ever pondered the importance of self-reliance, especially when it comes to national defense? It's a concept that resonates deeply with the essence of sovereignty, the ability of a nation to stand on its own two feet to protect and defend its people and territory. In the vast and intricate world of defense, self-reliance isn't merely about producing weapons. It's about ingenuity, innovation, and the relentless pursuit of technological advancement. It's about creating a robust defense ecosystem that not only meets domestic requirements, but also makes a mark on the global stage. India, a country with a rich history and an indomitable spirit, has been journeying on this path of self-reliance in defense production. This journey, while challenging, has been filled with numerous milestones and accomplishments. One such shining example of India's stride towards self-reliance is the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 didn't just appear overnight. It's the result of years of hard work, innovation, and a relentless pursuit of excellence. This isn't just a story of technological advancement. It's a narrative of India's perseverance, ingenuity, and the will to stand tall on the world stage. The conception of the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 began with a vision. A vision of an India that could not only defend its borders but also flex its military prowess, all the while being independent of foreign technology. The journey to bring this vision into reality was not a smooth one. It was a path laden with countless challenges, each one a test of determination. The initial development phase was a complex matrix of intricate design, rigorous testing and meticulous fine-tuning. The team of dedicated engineers and military experts had to overcome numerous technological hurdles but with each setback they only grew more resolute, their resolve fortified by the dream of an indigenous, self-propelled howitzer. As the blueprint of the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 started to take shape, the team faced the daunting task of making it a reality. The manufacturing process was a formidable challenge, requiring precision of the highest order. Yet the team's spirit remained unbroken. They worked tirelessly, their hands crafting a marvel that would soon roar with pride on the battlefield. With every bolt tightened, every gear set in place, the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 was inching closer to its birth. It was a labor of love, a testament to the indomitable spirit of the Indian people. And then the day arrived. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 emerged, a formidable beast of steel, power, and precision. Its birth marked a significant milestone in India's journey towards self-reliance and indigenous manufacturing. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 stands as a symbol of India's ingenuity and determination. It's not just a piece of machinery, but a beacon of our nation's capability to stand strong, to innovate and to triumph. It's a testament to the power of dreams, the strength of will and the unwavering spirit of a nation determined to carve out its own destiny. Now, let's delve deeper into what makes the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 a game changer in the field of artillery. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 is not just a weapon, but a symbol of strength and indomitable spirit. It's a testament to our nation's capability to independently design and produce world-class military hardware. But what exactly makes this self-propelled howitzer a force to reckon with on the battlefield? First, let's talk firepower. The Garuda 105 underscore V2 is armed with a 105mm howitzer, capable of delivering high explosive smoke and illuminating projectiles. This howitzer can fire at a maximum range of nearly 17 kilometers with standard ammunition and up to 20 kilometers with rocket-assisted projectiles. The firepower of this beast is further enhanced by its ability to fire 6 rounds per minute for 3 minutes and 2 rounds per minute for sustained fire. Now, that's what we call a rain of fire. But firepower isn't everything in the battlefield. Mobility is equally crucial. And the Garuda 105 underscore V2 doesn't disappoint in this area either. Its high power to weight ratio and compact dimensions allow it to traverse a variety of terrains with ease. It can climb steep slopes, cross water obstacles and navigate through narrow urban streets. Whether it's the rugged mountains or the dense forests, the Garuda 105 underscore V2 can reach where other artillery systems can't. This swift and agile beast is always ready to strike when you least expect it. Then there's the defense mechanism. 
The Garuda 105 underscore V2 is designed to survive in the harshest of conditions and against the toughest of enemies. It boasts an armored hull that can withstand attacks from small arms fire and shell splinters. The howitzer is also equipped with advanced communication and navigation systems, enabling it to stay connected with the command center and accurately locate targets. But the true strength of the Garuda 105 underscore V2 lies in its versatility. It can operate in a variety of roles from direct fire support to indirect fire missions. It can be used for counter battery fire, suppression of enemy air defenses and even for coastal defense. The adaptability of the Garuda 105 underscore V2 makes it a valuable asset in any battlefield scenario. So what do we have here? A self-propelled howitzer that packs a powerful punch, moves like a predator and defends like a fortress. A weapon that can adapt to any situation and is ready to face any challenge. A symbol of our nation's self-reliance and technological prowess. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 with its impressive features is ready to dominate the battlefield. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 is much more than just a piece of advanced artillery. It's a symbol of national pride and progress. Let's delve into the impact of this remarkable howitzer on India's defense sector. When we talk about the Garuda 105 underscore V2, we're talking about a significant leap in indigenous defense manufacturing. This leap has not only bolstered our defense capabilities, but has also ignited a sense of pride in our armed forces, knowing they are operating machinery made on home soil. This self-propelled howitzer has brought a new dimension to India's defense strategy. It has enhanced our artillery's reach, precision and firepower, reaffirming our military's preparedness and readiness. The Garuda 105 underscore V2 with its advanced design and superior technology, is an embodiment of our country's progress in defense manufacturing, proving that we are second to none. But the influence of the Garuda 105 underscore V2 extends beyond the battlefield. It's a beacon of India's self-reliance, the Atmanirbar Bharat vision in action. It's a declaration to the world that India can stand on its own, not just in the face of adversity, but also in the realm of technological advancement. The development of the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 has also contributed to India's global standing. It's a testament to our country's engineering prowess, innovative spirit and strategic foresight. It's a symbol of India's capability to produce world-class defense equipment, thereby strengthening our position in the global defense market. The ripple effect of this achievement can be felt across the nation. It inspires our youth to dream bigger and motivates our scientists and engineers to innovate further. It instills a sense of confidence in every Indian, knowing that we possess the ability to protect our land with our own manufactured prowess. So you see, the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 is not just a weapon. It's a symbol of our national resilience, our technological advancement and our unwavering determination to safeguard our sovereignty. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 is a testament to India's self-reliance and technological prowess. As we conclude our journey, let's take a moment to reflect on what the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 truly represents. A symbol of strength, innovation and national pride, this indigenous 105 milli self-propelled howitzer is far more than just a piece of artillery. Born from the fertile minds of Indian engineers, the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 embodies the spirit of self-reliance that India is known for. This formidable howitzer was not imported, not borrowed, but built right here on our own soil, utilizing homegrown technology and resources. It is a testament to the capabilities of our nation and a representation of our commitment to self-reliance. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 is not just a machine, but a marvel of engineering. Each of its components, from its highly agile platform to its advanced fire control system, speaks volumes about India's technological prowess. It stands as a testament to our nation's ability to create world-class cutting-edge weaponry that can stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with any global counterpart. This howitzer has not only bolstered our military strength, but also lit a spark of inspiration for our future generations. 
It serves as a shining example of what we can achieve when we put our minds to it. It encourages our young minds to dream big, to innovate, and to strive for excellence. But perhaps most importantly, the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 serves as a beacon of national pride. Every thunderous boom that emanates from its barrel is a reminder of our nation's strength and resilience. It is a symbol of India's indomitable spirit, its unwavering commitment to sovereignty, and its unyielding pursuit of technological advancement. So, as we reach the end of our journey, let's take a moment to appreciate what the Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 truly represents. It is a testament to India's technological prowess, a symbol of national pride, and above all, a beacon of self-reliance. The Kalyani Garuda 105 underscore V2 is not just a howitzer, it's a beacon of India's self-reliance and technological advancement.